If you don't have that much knowledge on the trend of certain items in the CSGO economy, starting to invest and just making a profit overall can be really tough. So today, I'm going to try and provide you guys with a bit more information on how to make good investments. And of course, if you do enjoy and you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. But for now, let's get right into it. I'm going to be talking about two different investments you can make in this video. First, current investments, and later on, I'll get into some future investments to look out for. Both of these options have pros and cons, so we'll talk about which is a safer choice and which might provide more profit. So let's first go over current investments and why they might cost a bit more money, but overall be the safer choice. When the Shattered Web operation ended, a lot of players didn't know whether or not the cases were going to be completely discontinued or become a normal drop. But now that the operation has been over for a while, it's pretty apparent that they aren't going to drop anymore. So the thing about this is that the cases have already gone up a considerable amount, but at the same time show no sign of going down, as they shouldn't since there's no possible way to get them anymore. And in my opinion, we'll probably see a similar price trend as to what the Operation Hydra cases had, and they're currently fluctuating around the $6.50 mark per case range. So the thing about this investment is that you're probably going to have to spend around $160 per case if you want to invest in shattered web cases, which can get kind of pricey if you're on a low budget, but at the same time, it's a pretty safe investment. If you want to buy more in bulk, certain stickers from the operation like WebSuck Hollows and Mastermind Hollows are also stickers that people seem to be interested in, and now they're both around $0.70 cents when they started at $0.40. Cents. These investments are safe because the stickers and cases are completely operation exclusive, so supply should only decrease and prices increase as time goes on and supplies get lower. But also, since the operation ended a while ago, prices have already gone up a bit, so you're gonna have to spend a bit more money to make a bit more money depending on how long you want to hold on to the cases or stickers or whatever you decide to buy. Which is why I now want to talk about future investments and why you should try to act fast rather than wait and have to spend more money. Investing when the next major is going on is always a great option for guaranteed profit, as towards the end of the major, you could get autographed sticker capsules at only 25 cents each. And usually in just a few months, they double in price and then end up reaching a dollar later on, which is two to four times profit depending on how long you sit on them. If you're just somewhat patient and want to hold on to them a few months, it's the safest investment that I always recommend. But because of the current situation in the world with COVID, the next major, which is supposed to be in Brazil, which is a current hotspot for the virus right now, most likely will be delayed, so you might have to wait a while for this investment, but at the end of the day, it'll be worth it unless CSGO devs for some reason decide not to do sticker capsules during majors anymore, which I highly doubt they'll do. I would say to invest in future operation items as well, but considering we're talking about CSGO devs here, number one, we don't know if there's ever going to be another operation, and number two, we don't know if it will be in the same format as Shattered Web, so I guess we'll just have to wait and see, but whenever there's operation exclusive items, they're pretty good to invest in since of course they're only limited time. So the pros to waiting for future investments like sticker capsules especially from the majors are that they're cheaper and usually show the same results every time a major comes. But once again with COVID going on, we don't know how long we'll have to wait before the next major because I honestly see it getting postponed again. So overall, just know that current investments will end up having a higher buy-in, I guess you could say. But based off the current trends they already show, and since the item quantity will only go down over time since the cases will be opened and the stickers will be applied, they should mostly go up in price over time. And for future investments, we don't know how long we'll have to wait for the next major, which always provides good investments with sticker capsules, but if you're patient, they always pay off. But yeah, besides that, that does pretty much wrap it up for this video, so hopefully you guys have a bit more knowledge on investing, and thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new, but for now, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.